Welcome back to Alex Snacks. I'm going to try some snacks. Alex Snacks! Whoop, whoop. Chip edition! Tonight, Alex, we're going to have you trying multiple types of chips. Some weird, some not, some all right. different. All different kinds of chips. And we're just going to throw you a bag, let you pop them open, let you try them, and let you rate them. All right, let's do it. All right. Chip number one. Good catch. Flaming Hot Lays. Okay, they <laughs> popped out the bottom. <laughs> All righty. All right, that's and they're ripping open. open. <laughs> what you thinking? I like them a lot. How hot are they? Are they flaming hot? They're hot, but I wouldn't say they're flaming. They're not flaming. How would you rate those on a scale of one to ten? I'll give them nine. All right. I'm gonna swap you out here, sir. All right. Chip number. Oh, I guess I should show you guys. Chip number two. Slim Jim now makes pork rinds, and these are hog wild. Also, we are instapotting in the background, so that's what you're hearing. Apologies. What do you think of those, Alex? That is really good. Are they porky? These are the best pork rinds I've ever had. Really? Yeah. Now, they did have another variety, which I did not buy you, that was called Squealin' Hot. Would you try these in a spicy version? Oh, yeah. Scale of one to ten, bud, what you got? Ten. Really? Yeah. All right. Ready for your next chip? Well. Oh, hang on. I lied. Let me see the back. Boom. Sorry. Here we go. Next one. <laughs> Cheddar jalapeno lays. <laughs> I don't really taste the jalapenos. No? No. Are they spicy or smoky or anything of that nature? Just cheddary. Really good. Scale of 1 to 10? I'll give these a 10. Well, actually, I'll give an A because I don't really taste the jalapenos. Okay. But they're... I can't complain about them. They're still really good. Next bag. Got a Lay's theme going. Still pickles. Reminds me back of the high school days. I would see these all the time. Dill pickle Lay's or pickles? Lay's chips. Still pickles. Oh. For what do you think of these end. ones? They're 10. Do they Bring, taste like a pickle? Yeah, brings me back to my hockey days. For every game, I almost ate these. Those days weren't that far behind you, sir. Okay, mm. next one. Kind of going in the theme of the hockey game. Game day chili. <laughs> we all know that you like you some chili. Yeah, I like chili. Yeah, you like chili too. We're done like chili. At this point. Yeah, he does. What you think of these? Do they taste like a bowl of chili? They really do. Really? Oh yeah. Is it's that a good thing or a bad thing? Good thing. I have to give them ten since they do actually taste like they say they do. Interesting.
We're going with Ruffles now. I taste the lime. Guys, I'm eating a lot of the flaming hot lays right now, and they're really good. But that dust got in my lungs. I don't taste the jalapenos. No, I, I do taste the lime. I don't know, maybe that flaming hot lay is uh, kind of toned down the jalapeno. Maybe. What would you rate those ones? Oh, you're fine. I'll give it an eight, just because they kind of taste the jalapenos. So kind of same with the cheddar jalapeno. I think that flame and hot took a lot of that out. Next we have just a traditional honey barbecue. Ooh, those are so good. <laughs> They're one of my favorite chips. Oh, they're good. Yeah, they're really good. So you're saying I should toss this over to you in the kitchen? For the record, guys, the lime and jalapeno, you do get a smokiness of the jalapeno, but there's no heat and there's, it's, a little underwhelming. Mm -mm. Thanks so. though. Ooh, no. Yeah, they're not good. Ooh. Oh look, he's trying the snacks. He doesn't seem like he likes it though. His face is kind of unsure. Next one. Limon. Limon. Is that supposed to be lime and lemon? Well, that was lime and... I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of this one. No? I you getting some lime flavor? What you getting? A lot of it. I'm not sure if I'm a fan of that. What would you rate it? Uh, I'll have to say six. All I mean, right. I'll eat it, but it's not like... Next up. My... How do you feel about Frank's Red Hot Sauce? I'll do it. Yeah. I smell Basically, that. Mon tastes like salt and vinegar, but instead of like the vinegar as much, it's lime. It's not good. Mm -hmm. No, those are pork rinds, right? Yeah. Think of those. Oh, that's a big bite. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Give it a nine. Yeah? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, okay. I like it. So. Alex, you yeah. were alive in the 90s, right? Yeah, I was born in 94. So, this next thing should kind of be a blast from the past for you. Okay. Good catch. <laughs> Three D Doritos. Yeah. Guys. They almost look like a bugle, but 
didn't have its bottom open. Yeah, and closed all the way around. What do you think of those? I like them a lot. I gotta give these guys 10. Well, I'm glad you like them. Because up next, Cool Ranch. 3D Dorito. Another 10. Really? Uh -huh. Just awesome. Which flavor do you like better? Hard to say. Oh, is this supposed to be spicy ranch? No. I mean, it says that they have a kick, but we all know that's a lie. Yeah, it is a lie. Yeah. Pricing, but this will give it ten because I like it. All right. Well, you know, one thing I'm very proud about with you, Alex, is ever since we did the one chip challenge, you've started to appreciate and have a love of spicy food, right? Yeah. I'm so glad to hear that. Flaming hot dill pickles. <laughs> yes, sir. Flaming hot dill pickle. The regular dill pickle, I just tried them. Smell disgusting. Tastes good. I'll be interested to try the flaming hot. Are they hot? Are they not on our level of hot now? No, you can taste the pickles though. How would you rate those? Kind of disappointing. I mean, you feel a little tiny zing, but it's like... They don't have enough zing. No, if you look on the table, that's the zing. <laughs> what Alex is referring to... That's what I got him on after the ghost pepper, or excuse me, not the ghost pepper, the one chip challenge, which is the same brand, but in the ghost pepper chips. Still gives you a wonderful mouth feel. Good spice, less dying. Very less dying. Much less dying. Next thing, kind of a twist on a staple, but Right? When did they start? We're not even gonna get into Good that. Good question. When did that happen? I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna try these flaming hot pickles. Okay, I've tried the dill pickle. I've tried the flaming hot. I have now tried the dill pickle flaming hot. Disappointment. Just go with the flaming hot. Oh, those are red. They are red. That is. That is red. You know, they have a little more zing. I don't know if it's the dill pickle that takes the zing out, but these have a little bit more of a kick. But, mm -hmm. they do. Compared to the pocket chip that she showed you? Nothing. This is nothing. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Another new thing that I saw <laughs> that I've been wanting to try. have a little bit of red in there. Okay. What do you think of these? That is. Yeah, do you guys see this? I would really hate to eat some of this flaming Hot stuff and then end up with like an upset stomach and not feel good and actually vomit. Because I would probably think I was dying because I would think all this red dye was blood. <laughs> this isn't hot either. No. I don't know if I just. It's like they my... put red food coloring 
on the white cheddar popcorn. It's still delicious though. You wanna try something? Can Me? That, yeah. Well, hang on, I got one more for you. Still, with this particular one, not gonna have anything on the Pocky, but that's your last one. Just pour a little bit of that hot sauce that I got for the ghost pepper one. Yeah. Don't challenge me with a good time, sir. You dip it into a chip. Or you can just pour some into the bag and shake the bag. Mm. Might get soggy if you don't eat it quick enough. Mm, that's yeah, true. That's where you dip it in. Because I haven't I haven't broken in yet. I've been waiting. Yeah? For me? We're the only other person that likes hot stuff. So he knows stuff. I won't touch that. I'll give you a run for your money. That'd be good in mac and cheese. <laughs> I will be. What do you think of the habanero? You're not getting the flaming hot one, P. I don't even know what it's habanero. It no? kind of tastes like a lime. Well, what the heck? Taste well, it. It doesn't even taste. <laughs> and for your viewers, since you went on about it. What did you mean? Habanero doesn't even smell spicy. No. They really taste like a lime. Mm -hmm. Doesn't it? This is terrible. <laughs> Suppressing. Oh. Yeah, these are gross. Don't get the habanero ones. Oh my god, that's disgusting. Of all the weird stuff we've seen you eat, this is the one thing I want to spit out. And the one day we don't have the trash. <laughs> it's okay. I, I can know. live, but man, this is terrible. I'm in slack and I have the trash can next to me. Well, we also haven't fed you like dead fish heads in a can in a while, so. <laughs> oh, just wait, your time is coming. You can always tell the ones that I pick because Alex gets wonderful nice snacks like have some chips and have this fun candy and make a gingerbread house. <laughs> and then Mal picks them and <laughs> we have dead fish in cans. <laughs> Alex, what was your favorite chip tonight? <sighs> I feel like you really like those 3D Doritos. I don't know if they can't pick my favorite, but. Definitely not the habanero. That one is definitely on the, la the last. Well, any other words of wisdom you want to give people on chips? Flamin' Hot's a lie. <laughs> yeah, Flamin' Hot is a lie and Maybe we should bring out the hot sauce. Dip a chip in it. Which chip? The chip do you want to do? If we're going to do it, we're going to do the ghost pepper chip. All right, let's do it. All I'm right. going. And for those of you that might be wondering what we were making in the Instant Pot, it's mac and cheese! We can't get enough of the mac and cheese. Come on, let's be real. Did you expect anything less? Now with you too. Mm. Instant pot mac and cheese. That's delicious. Game changer. Mmm. You're talking this one. Game changer. All right. All right. Many game changers. I forgot which one he was talking about. I forgot. So Alex was gifted this. It is from Hell's Kitchen in Vegas, right? I believe so. I believe in it Vegas. Stay on the bottle. Ghost pepper hot sauce. Hell's Kitchen ingredients: vinegar. Red peppers, salt, xanthan gum, ghost pepper, garlic, natural flavor. So interestingly enough here, ghost pepper isn't until about the fifth ingredient. Made in Minnesota. How do we say it up here though? Do we say Minnesota? Yeah. Minnesota. Minnesota. No. Minnesota. 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 You gotta say it like, <laughs> like how y'all say you got pop or bags. Bags. Although Alex did do good the other day. He really did. It's bag. 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 Good job. All right, so we're, you. we're slowly opening this guy here. Where did the ghost pepper ones go? Do you have them, Alex? Oh, no, no they're there. Yeah. No, you don't get any. I'm actually getting in this video with you. So I'll try to break this chip since they're such big chips. It's up that to was, you. Well, that was, that was one way to do it. That was horrible.
Mm. There. His and hers? Yeah, I don't care which. Okay. Just throw some hot sauce on them. Okay. You know what, though? Let's, Let's like not it. ruin the one sign that we've had since the beginning. Yeah, that's that ruined OG. I don't think we're ever going to get rid of that either. You know what? I don't think we can. I think it adds to the appeal. How much are we talking here? That's like Let's five see. drops, okay? Yep. I call the smaller one because I have a tinier mouth. Yep. Sounds good. Yeah, but can I take this from here? Do you have to feed it to me? Is it runny? No, it's, okay. it's, oh, it's a little runny. Cheers. Cheers. <clears throat> that dust always gets me on stuff. Where is the heat, sir? Are you getting any heat? Not really. Are you supposed to shake this shit? I did shake it. You did? And we did have a swear word just now. I guess we can't check that box. Darn. Fish sticks and pineapples. Fish sticks and biscuits. Yeah. I don't have any heat. The heat that I got is just from the... I get a smokiness. Pocket. Yeah, I'm having a smokiness, not a heatness. It's just the pocket chips. Yeah. That's the only heat. I mean, you can really taste the vinegar in it. Yeah, strong. But that is the first ingredient, so that is the most prevalent ingredient. Yeah. Well, I guess until our next spicy challenge, we're going to have to find something hotter. If you guys know something hotter, feel free to let us know. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Please subscribe and I will get a Facebook account set up before the next, next video, before the next one. So till next time, we'll see you later. <laughs>